example, Rhode Island wrestlers made quite an impact on the national level this winter, including this week's hometown hero who made some history on the mat. JP Smollins introduces us to North Kingstown's Nora Swain. <laughs> The third time is a charm for Nora Swaim at the high school nationals. The North Kingstown junior making the podium with a fourth place finish at 114 pounds, becoming Rhode Island's first female All-American. My experience has definitely, you know, grown and I've learned a lot better technique. And I think just the support of so many people have helped me get there and helped me train, especially my brother Connor and a lot of late night drives to get that, to get where I wanted to be, but it was definitely all worth it. Connor Swaim drew his sister to the sport and helped her develop on the mat. It's uh, amazing to see her, her growth and um, she's just really put in the work every single day. I don't think there's anyone else in the country who has um, competed as hard as she has. Nora will look to carry on her success this summer with her top flight wrestling academy team. She's set to head to Fargo in July for the U.S. Marine Corps Junior Nationals. Then she'll focus on her final season with the Skippers, chasing gold in a sport she hopes to pursue at the highest level. I would love to wrestle in college. I'm hoping to look out to a couple girls teams pretty soon, just reach out to college coaches and, you know, just put myself out there in any, any way I can, hopefully next year. Placing higher at Nationals, um, hopefully placing at Fargo this summer and just kind of setting myself up for a future wrestling, maybe wrestling coach eventually after college, I'm not sure yet. The fact that she can basically start her freshman year uh, wrestling and she's already taken from her freshman year to her junior year fourth in the country, um, I'm excited at the possibility of what she's going to do with the rest of her wrestling career. With your Cardi's Furniture and Mattresses, hometown sports hero, I'm J.P. Smallins.